Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome back to some more Satisfactory. Uh, yeah, it's been a while since I played. I know this is not the Let's Play world. Uh, Let's Play world was nowhere near this. Uh, this is actually a sol solo world I was working on on my own just to check it out before I actually did the Let's Play. And uh, as you can see, I did get somewhere. Uh, yes, it's quiet. And the reason why it's quiet is because we're now update 3 in the experimental build, as you see upper left corner there. Uh, they changed a few things. They changed a lot of things. They changed a lot of recipes. They changed machines. They changed so many things. And uh, they added something new. And some of you know about it. Some of you don't. But uh, yeah, one of the biggest th things they've changed is they've added pipes to the game. So all fluids, including a fuel, are pipe fed now. So my whole factory ground to a halt. Uh, because my fuel generators are not actually getting fuel because it's packaged. Uh, the packaged fuel you can actually get. Where? How did you make the packaged fuel? There's some. There's a machine now. Oh yeah, the re the refinery. Uh, the refinery now will take liquid fuel and empty containers to make the packaged fuel, which I guess is for shipment or your jet personal jetpack, for instance. And now raw resources. Uh, raw fuel has to be pumped in by a pipeline. So that's a big change. Uh, a lot of recipes have been changed. There's been uh, a lot of additions to the game. Uh, another thing they've done too is uh, we'll head over here to the coal generators. Uh, yeah, it was, it, it was a bit of a mess. I'm one of those people that uh, don't always plan ahead. It's just basically I try to find a place to fit it, and then you start getting this mess because it's like, oh, well, I need rods. I can get rods over there. Well, that's not enough. Well, I'll stick another constructor there, another miner there, another, you know. Yeah, and then up here, and then uh, this is the same thing. This is the refiners, so the refinery, and the conveyor is actually in the wrong spot. So, yeah, so now you have liquid fuel coming in. What is that blue thing? I have no idea what's going on here. Oh, uh, it's uh, the recipes here. Okay, plastic, and it uh, produces an, a waste now. And I have no idea what we do with the waste, but we'll figure it out when the time comes. It might be a dump or something we can use. Uh, yeah, so all sorts of new changes here. We'll figure that out when the time comes. So basically, uh, crude oil comes in the back here. It doesn't, it doesn't come in by barrel anymore. That's why you don't see any barrels on the line. There's probably nothing coming off that conveyor because it's supposed to be a liquid. And it comes out in here, it goes out there as fuel, and then that gets pumped into the, those things over there. The coal generators have changed. I uh, don't even want to know about the foundry. Uh, the foundry is the same, it just needs power. Nothing's got power because nothing's running. But, uh, yeah, it needs water input along with the coal to actually run. Nothing. Yeah. Oh, we had something going there for a second. And I'm guessing that's for, uh, for cooling purposes. And, yeah, so that is that. And there's one other thing they've added. Oh, uh, there's actually one other thing they've added, and I'll show you in the hub here. I haven't unlocked it yet. Uh, I'm not going to in this world, but we will definitely. Uh... We have purpose in the game now. All the the time and effort we spend to mass produce all these endless resources all have a goal now. And that is where is it here? The awesome sink. Excess resources, yeah, you just funnel them into this thing, it shreds them up, gives you points which you buy in game stuff and through the awesome shop. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome is right. But one other interesting little fun gadget here. Futurama tubes. Not exactly the cheapest things in the world, but it's great. And apparently you can harvest stuff on the way out. Go great distances. Really cheap, too. Uses about 10, uh, 10 kilowatts or something. I think that's what it was. Just like that. Hop back in, and off you go. New form of transport. Cool. Anyway, I'll meet you in the new world. And here we are. 
So, yeah, it's the uh, same map. I'm gonna see if I can actually find the same area I was at before. I have no idea where I am. I think the arch is here. It's over there. So, let's see if we can make it over there in one piece. I like going over there because there's uh, a lot of resources over there. Uh, at least I think that's where I'm going. Yeah, there's a po poison swamp. So we should be good. Uh, they do have a new starting sequence. You can skip the intro now. The whole hub tiers. So you don't have to upgrade it anymore. Now you start off with a bunch of miners. And uh, the hub kit. And some basic supplies to get some mining going if you want. I am not going to. Whoop. I'm not even equipped yet. No. 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 Not right now. Ha. You missed. Anyway, uh, which way was it? Just over here? Should be just over here. Just up on the top of the, top of the mountain there. On the other side. Uh, let's equip myself just in case. Yes, that was the wrong spot. And I gotta remember I don't have a jetpack. Well, that's what you get for doing that. Uh, yeah, so this sh should be interesting. I've never really gotten too far in this what you saw was about as far as I got. Uh, being the experimental build, there are a few bugs. As they always are. I'll come and grab that, that slug later. I do like this spot because you have the, the limestone right there. And uh, I'm going to be dropping a couple of miners down right away. I do have to take care of this guy here. Hello. Oh, you got me. Come on. Let's see if we can get him again. And he's gone. Thank you. He only got me once. Oh, shut up. Uh, another one they changed too is they've changed the way MAM is set up now. Now MAM isn't part of the hub. Now you actually have to. Uh, oh, yeah. Click. Uh, now you actually have to build it separately, and uh, apparently, from what I can tell, is the space elevator is built in stages now. Uh, you have different things you actually have to craft for the elevator. Uh, if the UI has changed, it tells you what items can be used in the current open GUI. For instance, what equipment I can use, or uh, you open up your a miner or a smelter, it'll only show you the ores that you can put in there. So that's good. So yeah, I got four iron up here, which is a good spot. And I got some copper over there we'll get. Let me get this. Oh, it's a random spawn. That was a criterium before. But let's go and get uh, these guys. Well, not before. And another little test world I was working on. Hello. Best thing is it stuns them too on the first hit. And your friend. It's almost like I've done that before. Okay. So we'll drop two more down here. One. Oh. Uh, come on, hands to work. Two. And let's go clean that copper. Yeah, there's a couple more iron mines over there too, which is really good. And around the corner, there's more iron and some coal. And good spot. Just start grabbing all this too while I'm on my way. Gonna be burning a lot of it. But yeah, I got copper just over here. Uh, I know there's a Mercer Sphere up there, but there is absolutely no use for them right now. They have not been implemented. Uh, still a work in progress, right? The game that is. Okay, there's only one. Come here, you. Now, what I'm gonna do instead of. Uh, I'm sorry, he distracted me. Uh, instead of building stuff. Am I out of miners already? Ugh. Where did I put them all? I thought I had. I thought I had six of them. Oh, no, 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 because I was looking up top, too. 
So I only had four. But yeah, anyways, what I was saying is uh, instead of uh, actually getting equipment going first, I want to do a uh, tier upgrade first so I can get foundations. So at least we can get some organization like right from the get-go. Uh, I'm probably going to set my hub up there, which means I have a couple more guys to deal with. Let's go take care of that right now. Ashley, let's go empty this out. Empty these out. So that way I can get more. Oh, no. Do not pick you up. I did not want to do that. Uh, wrong button. Oh, before I go right in, I'll make sure I don't do something stupid. Well, very stupid, I'll say. I'm sure it can. Just like every other game. Come on. Ow. Did a bit of a face plant there. Now where was the other guy? He's gonna sneak up on me, isn't he? I saw two of them over here. Oh, guess not. Let's go. All right, let's go get some more. Oh, yeah, that's what I was doing. I was setting up the hub here. Okay, the hub. Uh, let's see where size the generators on. They're on this side, so let us do that. That works. Okay, yes, we open that up, get rid of that question mark, and this, and this is the first one I want, just so I can get the foundations. And that's it. Uh, so, the plates I have, and this is what I mean about relevant items, is it shows you what you can actually put in there. So, I gotta gather up some iron, gather up iron for rods and concrete, and I shall return. I knew there was another one around here somewhere. He's hiding. That cave is still here. Come on, come on. Don't you be running from me. That's what I thought. Uh, do gotta eat, though. Eat my nuts. That's right. Okay. Yeah, so seeing that whole relevant item items thing here, like that, that explains why I thought I had two Xeno Zappers. Yeah, I'm smart. Anyway, I, I got a few craft, a little bit of crafting to do, and I'll be back. And I'm done. All right, so now we can go ahead and load that up, load that up, and load that up, and launch. Now, it, uh, like I said, it is early access, so the pod technically isn't here. Uh, and, uh, yeah, apparently, if, uh, where is it? It's not going to show. Apparently, it's going to be like an hour before it returns. Oh, now it says two minutes. Hmm, <laughs> weird. Uh, another world I was checking out said like an hour five minutes anyway so that is good so now I have concrete or not concrete I have foundations and they are six a piece now I did make some extra so uh, let me get some more and we'll start doing some paving okay I'm back and I think this would be a good time to actually you know, get our first miner town and of course it's gonna be right here because this is what I want Eventually. Oh, wrong button. And of course I have to dismantle a node. Uh, so what I'm thinking of doing is having a vast flat area. Try to get as much uniformity as possible. Now if you sort of understand what I'm talking about. Uh, okay, let's uh, rotate this. Let's see. We're going to be... Try to go with, try to get to go with the grid that we're gonna have. Okay, so I do need power. Uh, some light will help too. 
Uh, where is the power going to get set up? Hmm. I guess what I'm thinking about doing is let's go here. I'm more or less going to be a flooring off the entire area. And I think these are new. I don't think I've ever seen the one by eights before. Now, hopefully, hopefully I don't actually place things in the wrong spot too many times. Now, hopefully the conveyor will actually reach up top. I was hoping I'd have a buffer chest, but we'll see how it goes. And then we connect this over to the other, other wall here. Um, the world is our factory. They don't need no buildings. God, no. Although it would be quite the feat to build a, build a roof over top of this place. Alright, uh, that should be good for now. Uh, Got to get some power set up. Let's get up top here. I have to have to get some stairs and also, like I said, remember the, the fact that I don't actually have a jetpack. What is that sparkle? Oh, yeah. The iron, of course. Uh, power. Biomass. Let's get... Hmm. Now I'm wondering... I'm going to have to expand this way. Uh, you know what? I'm going to place it down for now. And then we'll go down here. I'm going to place a container. If I can find it. Place a container right there. Get the old conveyors in. Like so. Uh, power. Oh my god, it's like I know what I'm doing. No. <laughs> no, I don't know what I'm doing. So that's got to go into a uh, constructor production into constructor and conveyor that all up. Invalid shape. What do you mean? Looks like a conveyor belt to me. Okay, let's try that. There we go. Now we go get a container at the end. And this is just temporary. Nope. Because this is going to be able to make that make concrete a lot faster than I will. Okay, and conveyor belt there to there. Get some power. And there to. Where are you? Oh, there. Let's try this again. And there we go. Alright, so all you're doing is making concrete. Go. Oh, that's right, no jetpack. Do I have stairs yet? No. Hmm. Gotta take the long way. Well, I do have to take the stairs. It's okay. I know what I'm doing. Uh, except for the fact that... Can I even make that biofuel now? Let's put a craft bench down. Uh, let's see here. Production. Craft bench. There. It's like Minecraft. I always hear a crafting table with you. Uh, let's see. What do we have for... Yeah, we don't have it yet. That are solid biofuel. That's actually pretty good, but th this works good too. So let's go ahead and make some biomass. And that'll be enough because that's all I can actually hold right now. I think it only holds 100. Uh, we have power. Okay. Alright, that is going on. Uh, let's uh, actually check the next milestone while we're waiting and see what we're going to head next. Uh, yeah, I was wondering if they still had that cave there. Oh, yeah. Cave's still there. We'll worry about that later. Okay, logistics, uh, productivity display, conveyor mergers. Also, too, I don't know if it's something that they added recently or something I just forgot about, but apparently these things are actually stackable. So that's cool. Uh, field research. And this is where MAM comes in. We get inventory slots. Beacon. The object scanner is nice. 
And then there's one of the new things that we can make, copper sheets now, which you actually need for the tubing. Uh, there's smart plating. This is, as you can see, uh, a project part. I think that's part of the space elevator. And I think there's some other ones in this one here. But yeah, we can actually get into the resource sink if we want. I think it's a little too early for that. This one might be useful just because of the solid fuel. I think what was in here. It's a good question. Where do we go? Uh, hmm. Let's go for the awesome shop. No, that we're not gonna do that. Uh, chainsaw is kind of pointless because I can't make biofuel anyway, so I think it's going to be uh, That's the thing is that's just an object scanner Part of something might be a smart one Sorry if I have trouble figuring this one out I think this one might be a good one. I'm saying that about everything. Ah, uh, we'll do this. We'll, we'll get we'll get Mammy back. Okay, let's go see how much concrete I have. I'm sure I've got enough to pave half the world by now with this high technology, high tech technology. 33, all right. Rolling it. Okay, well, uh, let's see what we got for resources. Uh, I need more plates. Of course, I need plates. All right, well, I'm going to grab get a few things together, and uh, I'll bring you back when i got some concrete to work with. Okay, I'm back. I decided to drop a couple of portable miners down there and uh, help out a little bit. So let's see what we have here. We have about, oh, about 600, I think. Uh, 600, yeah, we can do but almost 100 tiles, so that'll be good. So let's run up here. Also, I went ahead and made a whole bunch of biomass, put it in the container for now. This actually works out. It's going to be almost perfectly level with the hub. And I was hoping that it was going to line up with those iron mines over there, but it's going to be a little high. But it should be perfect to span right across the, the canyon there, valley, whatever you want to call it, and just go right to the other side. Uh, this has been doing pretty good, but I haven't been really using as much power as I could, and I just got basic storage here. That's my small little black box. Yeah. Anyways, so now we can go ahead and start building a foundation. I do got to get some stairs eventually. There's something satisfying about building this way. You know, you watch these massive things come out of nowhere. Uh, yeah, anyway, uh, I'm gonna do a little bit of paving in midair here, and I shall return. I missed a spot. Oh, look. It's Lizard Doggo. Now, let's go say hi. Gotta be careful, though. Uh, last time I snuck up on him over there in uh, the quick little test I did before the recording, he was... Not looking too happy. Which he is now. I'm wondering if he's feeling intimidated. Can I crouch? I can. I think I was supposed to offer him some food or something. Come on, it's okay. Oh, well, even me. I got paving to do. Okay, I'm back. I'm just crafting up a few things right now. Uh, I think this is one of the recipes that might have actually changed. They said that most recipes have changed. Uh, as you can see now, it's three ingots for two plates. I think it was uh, two ingots for one plate before. So it's, I think, about 50% cheaper. At least I think. Uh, the rod is still one to one. Uh, the screws, screws have changed. 
Uh, is it one to four now? One to four. I can't remember what the recipe was before. I think it was like three to twenty-four or something like that. Uh, but yeah, I'm just making a few things because I think we're gonna start getting a few machines up and running here. Uh, I do have to make a few more miners. I got this set up. I did do a little bit of paving, just a little. Uh, the limestone can't keep up to me. That's <laughs> that's for sure. But I'm thinking about throwing a couple of biomass generators here. Uh, oh, not a constructor. Power, yes. Okay, can't afford. What do you mean I can't afford? Oh, I need copper. I need copper. That's fine. Because I have copper. Yes. Whip up a couple of ingots. And, uh, yeah, the wire recipe changed too. Yeah, it's uh, a little more expensive now. And why? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm like, oh, my wire's going up, but my cables aren't going up. It's like, it, it just occurred to me that I'm making ingots, not wire. Anyway, let's do that. And I'm going to do this. A few more things. Uh, one of the things I do, do actually remember, because I have watched one video with the, the so-called awesome sink. And uh, it's actually something that I want to get. It's called a factory cart. It's a tiny little blue and yellow cart that's perfect for going through factories like this where you got multiple multiple machines you can go whipping down through the tiniest little gap uh, it's just like the the transport too uh anyway let's get some power going uh, uh let's see i'll probably build let's see do 30 let's do three i'll probably keep that one for now uh and i'm gonna try to keep things uniform here all in line and neat and perfect. Okay, and we'll place a pole. We should place a pole. I don't care. Right there. Okay, now we go to get the power, connect you and you and you, and I'll probably have to go get more copper eventually. Let's go over here. We'll take this one apart. Run all the way over here, and I'm gonna add these out. These out while I'm here. It's almost like I knew what I was doing when I built that, because I think that's just the the highest point you can drop before taking fall damage. I think, anyways. Uh, what's the quickest way? <laughs> yeah, I need stairs. I need stairs. Gotta run all the way back over here. I probably gotta go the other way because I have to go further this way. Because I have to go around and back up. Oop. And that's where the the few trauma tubes come in. Just walk underneath the tube, shoots you up to the next floor like an elevator. In theory, anyways. Okay. Oh. Uh. Oh yeah. All right, we might as well take this while we're here. Uh, let's see here. Hmm. I guess grid really doesn't matter right now. We'll just go as far as we can. Missing concrete. What do you mean I'm missing concrete? It's impossible. How can I be missing concrete? Like, I never use this stuff. Like, seriously, I don't. I think I can get up this way. Ooh, berries. Nuts. Even better. And up. And back to here and take you copper. That's okay because I was I was smart. I put a crafty bench over here. Uh, let's see. No, 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 no. Uh, 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 that's what I'm doing. Yes. Fortunately, I don't need very much wire. And we'll do this. And it just occurred to me that I could be just taking taking apart this thing anyway, since I don't actually need it. Okay, and we do that to there, and let's see, where is this one? Okay, now we just gotta fuel it. Grab all the biomass, and uh, I don't know if this is something that's been added or always been there, but control click takes everything, if you have the, if you have the inventory space for it. Alright, this will get us powered up, then I can, we can go drop some miners down. 
perfect. Okay, some for you, uh, some for you, and I'm just gonna go with two for now. Because we don't have a whole lot built yet. Okay, so what do I need? I need a uh, workbench. Uh, nope, that's the wrong one. Workshop. And you know what? I built this like this for a reason because this thing. But now, now do I have enough concrete? I do. Okay. Oh, I hate, hate it when I do that. Come on, where are you? I know you're in there somewhere. I want my concrete back, damn you. Aha, there you are. No idea what that is. Oh, okay, I thought I put it in the wrong spot. That's fine. I'm rambling. Yes, I am. What else am I going to do to come up with good content? Actually play the video game properly? No. That's not entertaining at all. No, it's not. Ugh. I'm going to take that one out just to get to this one. Uh, sometimes the snapping's good, sometimes it's terrible, especially if you're like me. Okay, now I gotta make sure I have enough room for the, for these miners too. And I think that should do it. I think that was actually the right spot. Because uh, when you place it immediately, it snaps to the bottom, the hologram, so you don't really know. Alright, now we can go back to the hub. Back to the hub, I said. And then we can have it snap to the ground. Or the, the whole foundation here. Uh, there's good. And then we'll get a, a work shop. Really? I could technically move it. Let's do it. Put the workbench down first for the workshop. I don't know why I call it workbench. Okay, and then we go to the hub. And I really should look at figuring out what the hotkey is to go back to the menu. It's not right click, I know that. Yeah, let's do this properly. I want to have it lined up at the front of that workshop there. Come on. I think it's that one. Yes, it is. Perfect. Okay, so we go in here, we go. Uh, I'll make a few miners. One. Uh, no, I won't. On the inventory space. Oh, I got the hub. Yes. Uh, dump all that in there. What else can I dump in there? Uh, oh, concrete. <laughs> what do you know, concrete? <laughs> okay. So, let's see, I need... Uh, one for the copper. Two... I might as well get all four for the, the iron. Okay, and let's see what I need for the, uh, the miners. I know we're running along here. Uh, plates. So, let me gather some supplies together and we'll get ready. Okay, I'm back. It is uh, dark, but that's okay. The moon's coming up. It's nice and bright. But I do have a bunch of stuff out with me, with, uh, with me, except for the concrete, which I gotta run over here and grab. So let's uh, drop down here, and then I think I left an opening here so I can get out. So we just hop down here and grab everything, take it all, and run. Okay, uh, I'm gonna probably leave this like this. Let's actually. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, foundations. Let's actually hotkey that, why don't we? Uh, okay, yeah. Okay, so it's on five now. Let's place it in the right spot, too. Okay, and there we go. 
So at least I have a spot to walk on. Now let us run over here and get our copper miner down. Grab some more leaves along the way. Making plenty of bio biomass. We're going to need a lot of biomass. We're going to go through a lot of biomass. And, uh, yeah, that's just, <laughs> that's just the beginning of it. All right, I do have enough inventory space. Okay. So now we go to a miner. Now, I think I'm just going to send all ores to the base. Or the f factory. Oh, I uh, hit the wrong button. I always do. Q and E to rotate. And then in some games, it's page up, page down. And this one, it just happens to be mouse wheel. Okay, now, uh, conveyor time. Oh, come on. There we go. And off we go. My personal transport. Now, so I'm thinking about having basically all the conveyors in one spot. Or, like all the smelters in one area, and then they go off to, like, a big area of constructors and then from there they go to other places so trying to figure out how I want stuff to come in kinda you know what I mean uh, also knowing where everything is like I know that there's only this one the copper that's here and that's about all there really is in this area so maybe yeah, I could probably have just a copper here for instance Okay, and then there's a good spot to set up this right here. All right, so uh, it's going to be going into containers from here. Let's see here, and space it on the tile itself if I can. Sure, there, and this is just to give it room for other equipment. I can't afford it. What are you talking about? I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. And I think I do have everything now. Uh, okay, so I was thinking about how, which way I was going to go with this. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to have all these lines coming in from this side. Because I do, like I said, do have some iron and coal around the corner here. And I think there was something else over this direction. I know that uh, uh, Caterium comes from that direction as well. So what I'll probably do is I'll probably have all the inputs coming in this way, and then I have all the, the conveyors lining up in a row, and then running off in this direction, maybe we'll use that whole expanse as to a factory floor. So yeah, okay, so I got the copper there. So let's get uh, get a couple more containers down. Do have to think about the four miners behind, or the four iron behind me. And I do actually want to get those in the system. So we are going to line that up there and I think these ones are going to go over here I'm not sure to capture all four of these do I have concrete oh I do what do you know it's a miracle I'll probably be using that joke forever okay anyway uh, organization storage container in fact uh, let's do the smart thing here There we go. So now I go to six and get my containers right on the fly. So I got four of them here, so let's do that. Uh, okay, one. Uh, floor is too steep, I don't think so. Two. Uh, three. Is that the wrong spot? Yes, it is. I think it is. No, that was the right spot, apparently. What was that? Three or four? That's three. Okay, four. Okay, now let's go get some miners down. And please tell me I have enough stuff, enough supplies. I do. Okay, good. Hey. Oh, this is going to hurt. No, I don't jump on that. Uh, okay, we're going to pick you up. And I should have enough room for you. All right, minor number one, please. Let's see here. Okay, we'll face you that way. Face you that way. And go up here. 
<laughs> I jumped up. I saw the hologram. I thought there was a miner here already. Okay, and then I think you like so, and then we'll probably sneak you in, be in between them. How's that look? Go that way. Okay, conveyor time. And I realize I don't have enough plates, which means I'm gonna have to do some more crafting. Thank Thankfully, I picked up a whole bunch of iron from these those miners. Okay, you gotta go there, and you gotta go there. Uh, I'm just doing this for buffer. It's how I do things. Yeah, I'm gonna need a lot more plates. I'll be back. Hey man, you try to take my stuff for what? Uh, he'll probably be hanging around here for a while. I've seen him around here already. I'm gonna leave it to a vote. Do we let him hang around or do we scare him off? It's up to you to decide. I'm not gonna be the judge of that one. Anyway. Okay, I'm back. Now, I real I'm starting to realize I'm gonna need a lot of conveyors. I'm gonna use a lot of, wanna use a lot of conveyors because I don't really wanna have everything bunched up here. Literally I wanna have wanna have containers here with them bunched up and then actual rows of conveyors going. Like I could probably move the copper over to about here, but basically from about here to just like a row of smelters going to a set of conveyors to a row of constructors and so on and so forth. And so that's sort of what I'm planning. Um, so I'm sort of thinking about going this way. I do have a little bit more concrete on me. I picked up some more and go from there. But let's get the, the plates going. I'm just going to set something up here temporary, temporarily. <sighs> yes. I might have to put some more coffee on. but I'll... Oh, I missed my reinforced plates. And I had them... Um... I think I put them over here. Let's go check, shall we? I'm not doing too bad. I haven't got, well, I don't have anything hooked up yet, but we're only running off of one generator. Uh, there they are. Thank you. Not that they're hard to make. They're actually really easy to make by hand. Okay, constructor, please. Uh, actually, yeah, constructor. For some reason, I was thinking, oh, no, I need an assembler, but no. Oh, 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 who spotted that mistake? Who spotted that mistake? Yes, I got smelt at first. <laughs> Come on, where's the line up? That's not a line up, is it? That is, supposedly, yes, it is. Okay. Uh, conveyor to there, and I'll get another storage container. Nope. Uh, Yeah, we'll do a container just in case. Because I don't think the smelter's going to be able to keep up, but this will just work for now. Oh, I don't have parts. Hang on. Okay, as I was saying, uh, going into a storage container. Put that there, and then uh, I'm out of rods again, but that's okay because <coughs> I can make some quickly. And then we're going to go into the constructor. We're going to turn that into plates, and then we're going to go into another container, which I'll need more, more, more rods for. If we keep them, we'll have to do a little contest who, who gets to name him. And I'm sorry, Iron Hand, you've had, you've had your share. It's somebody else's turn. Anyway, uh, let me get some more rods together, and we'll be back. Okay, I'm back, and I should have enough. Uh, I did a little bit more, a little bit more paving with whatever concrete I had, and we're getting there. Oh, and I walked into a container, and I got a right near, but uh, uh, we'll call, we'll keep him, call him George. Sure. Oh, let's uh, get used to using the hotkeys here, and we'll do that, and then we'll do uh, that, and that, and uh, that should be it for this line. And I actually want to get this going because, uh, like I said, I need plates. Lots of them. Probably get the... Uh, actually, I think I have enough to get everything else set up, too. Let's see here. Okay, this is connected. Okay. 
Uh, we'll get some stuff set up for now. We'll, we'll move everything once we uh, uh, <laughs> think. Get some supply, some stock on hand. Yes. Okay. Even though it's temporary, I'm going to try to be uniform with what I do. All neat and lined up like so. Uh, I need rods. And now I don't. So now all I gotta do is hook up to, hook it up to the power and pretty glad it holds up. And that's not a conveyor, that's not a power line. Uh, well, it'll hold up. We're just gonna add some fuel. Uh, I think two of them should hold up. I think they should be good. Uh, yeah, I'll get 200 each. And a power. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh oh, uh oh, never mind. No, uh oh. Okay, do one there, and then I have to do two of them. Uh, three of them actually. One there, and we'll do one there, and then we'll do there and there and oh, not there. I'll we'll do this one to there, uh, this one to there, and. You're gonna need two more down here. Actually, no, we don't. We only need to these two right now. And I'll do that, and one, and two, and we're running for now. Just wait till everything else goes up and running. I think I'm gonna have to get some more fuel in the some fuel in the third generator there. Quick. Before we lose power. Okay, uh. That's all I have, but it works. So, yeah, like I said, this is gonna be temporary for now. And we'll see uh, what I plan on doing. Just like, like I said, I wanna get moving down this direction. Uh. I'll probably end up moving the storage crates to about this line here, like I said. How many can I get here? Uh, well, we got those these two nodes here too as well. Uh, I could probably go here. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm gonna get me six. So we might have to stack them. That's always fun. Yes. All right. Let's see if we actually have anything being crafted. No, we don't. You know why? Because I'm an idiot. Yes, I am. Iron, please. Uh, iron, please. And then we go over here. And uh, we'll make plates and rods. Now, I know there's probably some sort of ratio of smelters to craft and the constructors I can use to miners. But once you start adding power shards and overclocking things, it doesn't really matter because it's the end product. Uh, end goal you really gotta think about there we go rods plates that is going good and while we're at it hello my friend uh, I'm also get some copper going uh, I think the only thing we really need right now is rods so get you in here and I'll just have it going this way for now I think I have an actually I do have enough for one more constructor Perfect. But first, we gotta smelt it, and uh, I have a feeling I'm gonna run out of rods, and I'm gonna place it the wrong way. Of course, I will. I'm hearing some weird sounds. I have no idea what that is. Okay, go to six. Add a storage, and then yeah, a constructor make wire and then a storage oh yeah <laughs> I was like what I'm out of materials no that's not a conveyor belt yeah and connect it all up like so and now we just hook up some power uh, let's see, free power line, free power line. 
over here. Okay, and up we go. Ready to blow the fuse. The best thing is conveyors, you can ride them. Oh, called it. Out of rods. Now the question is, do I have enough cable? Oh, I do. Okay, and can I go straight to? Yes, I can. All right, we are full production. No, we're not actually. I forgot, <laughs> I forgot to set the smelter and the the crafter. Okay, I want to see what the output. Sixty per minute. Okay, because this is something I've got to be checking. So sixty per minute on that. Let's see what the smelter can do. Smelter is probably going to be like thirty per minute, so I might be able to split it off. But you know, I'd probably be upgrading a smelter before anything. It doesn't really matter what you do; it's going to cost the same, anyways. All right, uh, you making copper? You can do thirty per minute. Yeah, so I can run two smelters off of one. Not that I care about that right now. Go to wire and. 30 per minute. Okay, so you need 15 cop per minute and 30 per minute. So that means I could have two lines running off of this if I wanted. If I wanted. Uh, I haven't decided what I'm going to do yet, but like I said, overclocking is always an option. So I personally like to have one machine running faster than multiple machines running, but we'll see. Let's see how it goes. And we are doing good for rods. I always took half a stack. We got plates. And now we just gotta wait for all this copper to come down and shut the system down. Also, too, besides the fact that we have another friend here we have to deal with, let me get my little zappy stick here. Uh, they changed all the ores, too. Like the models of the ores. Oh, he sees me. See, the copper actually looks different now, and same with the iron and the coal and all that stuff. It has different models, so it actually looks pretty good. I like it. Hello. Uh, Tango? You bit me, you bugger. Okay. Moment of truth. Is the grid gonna hold? Oh yeah, it will. Everything's running. And that's only because I got that third generator up and running. So we are on our way. Um, I think we can call this one here. I'm gonna let the supply build up a little bit for conveyors and machines and stuff like that, and we'll continue our adventure, get our conveyor highway going off into the canyon, full of resources and stuff to craft and stuff to burn for fuel and everything. Anyways, I thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.